and what's up guys, Sega Tenshi here. Today we're gonna play Final Fantasy X, so we're on episode 2. So, in the previous episode, we've seen Sin. Yeah, he sucked up all our life force and went somewhere else. But, yeah, now I'm currently in... I don't know what this name is. Kinda like a temple to me. Oh, an item. Nice. Ooh, high potion. Why am I not surprised? There we go. Oh. I don't like that one. Oh, holy shit. Hey, there's something there. I wonder what that is. Hold on. Oh. Um, I wonder what that is. I think that's a saga. All right, it's showtime. There we go. I really like that music. Kill this. Mm, overkill. What? What? Why? Oh, no! No, that's my- that's my kill! You stupid a-hole! Alright, that's it. Oh, wow. You're huge. I'm not afraid of you. Take that, you. Oh, 30, shit. No, oh, no, 260. Hmm. I'll give you a 60. No, oh. Holy crap. No, I'm dying. Damn you. Yeah, that's right. How can he talk underwater? Oh yeah, I can't blame myself. That's Final Fantasy. What do I expect? No, so close. Lucky bastard. I had made it out of the frying pan and into the freezer. I thought I was going to die in this place. You are going to die soon. Hey, hey we're safe. Damn him. So we're inside the temple. Oh, 
Oh. Wow, you're so strong. The remains of a campfire. With flint and tinder, we will start another fire here. Wait, how do I pronounce it? Tinder or tinder? Well, whatever. Um, hmm. So, let us start by sir. Maybe statue. How do I pronounce that? Either or either. Whatever. Oh hey! You can use that. So we gotta search for Ooh, an item. A high potion. So we got ourselves a uh, whited, whited flower, withered flower. I don't care. So I guess let's go here. No, it's not. Why am I here? Oh, this is not the place. Oh, yeah. Well, it's been a while since I last played this. Hey, Eflin. Lucky you. So we're gonna save this for a moment, and that'll be the end of our air wait. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's still eight minutes though. Eight minutes and fifteen seconds. I guess. There we go. Interesting. He made fire and he's strong too. Sorry, drinking water. I need food. Now you want food. That's great. What do, what do you, you want? want? It was a bad call. Your team lost because of you. You came to say that? It's been 10 years. <sighs> I thought you'd be crying. Who, me? You cried. Hey, shut up, fool. Everybody cries for a reason. Oh, wait, what the hell was that? Uh, 
Hey, wait, wait! Uh, don't go out on me! Uh, uh, just hold on. I'll get more wood. Uh oh. Well, hello. You're so fast. Ah, Give shit. Me a break. Let's break him, alright. Take that. Oh! Oh! Hey, we're evenly matched. Yeah, that's right. Oh! No, I'm dying! Hold on. Let me use my pots. Yeah. Oh! This please. Wow, some boss we got here. Ah, what now? Why do they always interrupt my fight? Ooh, shit! Borderlands! Wow, sexy. Borderland enemies. Ha. <laughs> Game reference. Oh, really? You on my side? Cool! Using grenades. Certain items like grenades have special effects when used. These items can only be used during battle by selecting special ability use. Okay. I'll just throw a grenade! Oh yeah! There you go. Ooh, 300. Why am I still in critical? Gonna throw a grenade! Oh yeah! Yeah! There it is. Oh! Why is it always me? Eh, not again. Steal this. Yeah, I get a grenade again. Take this, please. You're still alive. Oh, no, why? There we go. Who ability spear? Okay. Yeah, that butt. Sexy. Wow, weird. Phew. <laughs> that was close. Oh. Hey, let me go. Redek Drek. What? Hey, stop that. Trivia de Crisa! Trivia de Crisa! Oh no, my stomach! Well, actually, I remember that part. She said sorry. No! You stupid Borderlands, where are you taking me? Ah, uh, another loading. Shit. Interesting. Is that a ship?
kid did die job. Uh -oh. Hey, that hurts. Oh, Sujek, Rain. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Oh, hey. Hey, nurse. Oh, sorry. Right, whatever. <laughs> I said I don't understand. Hey. Fed! He said you can stay if you make yourself useful. You... You understand me? Oh, you speak English now? Ow. All right, I'll work. Oh, asshole. Oh, wait. Let me, let me see first, damn it. So that I can heal. So, okay, we're... Uh, I don't know where we are. Ah, uh, location, salvage ship, deck. Oh, okay. Ooh, I got a potion. What, you're not gonna give me something? Eh. Uh, I think he said, I know Kung Fu. How about you? Oh, almost forgot. You see the spear grid. A spear grid is used to develop your characters by activating nodes with spheres. Let's see how this is done. Oh, I like that music. So, okay. Select spear grid from the main menu. Cursor appears at the selected character's current position. Use the directional buttons to move the cursor, like up, down, left, and right. Information on upgrades is displayed at the top of the screen. This location is for defense upgrades. Well, this one lets you learn an ability. Oh, okay. These upgrade locations are called nodes. Characters are upgraded by activating these nodes. A character must move near a node in order to activate it. Let's go through this step by step. By pressing X, the cursor returns to the character's position and a list of commands appear. Select move. Display the number of steps the character can move. Well, the number of steps a character can move is equivalent to his S level or spear level. Spear level are gained by getting AP or Ability points, which are obtained by participating in battles. Characters must fight battles to gain AP and obtain spear levels, which are in turn used to move around the grid. In, yeah, in short, if characters do not participate in battles, they will not grow stronger. What well, sucks to be them? In this case, Tidus has four spear levels, so he can move up to four steps. In general, you should be careful not to move too fast, as you may forget to activate nodes you passed over. So let's take the one step. And learn the ability cheer. Note that you do not have to be at a node to activate it. You can do it from an adjacent node as well. Selecting a destination. Spear level are spent and the character will move. Okay. Yeah, when the character arrives at the designated spot, we will ask for final confirmation. If the destination is correct, select yes. At this point, the movement process is complete and cannot be cancelled. If you want to activate nodes you passed over, you must spend spear level to go back. Wow. When you are retracing your steps, you can move 4 steps by spending 1 spear level. However, Going back every time is not very cost efficient. Always plan ahead to avoid wasting spear levels. Now, since the character is in position, let's activate a node. Okay. Spears are items that can be obtained by various means, but mainly by defeating enemies. Press X and select use. 
A list of spheres currently in stock will be displayed. Every sphere has a special function. So, for example, power spheres are used to activate strength, defense, and HP nodes. Ability spheres activate ability nodes. Nodes that can be activated are the node at the character's current position and nodes directly adjacent to it. This means nodes that are one step behind or ahead can also be activated. In this example, the only node that can be activated is an ab what the fuck? I, I pressed X accidentally. When you press a sphere, the nodes that can be activated by that sphere at the position are highlighted. The spheres have been selected here, so only the ability nodes will glow. By selecting a node you want, nice. It will activate and the character will learn its ability. Note that one ability sphere was used during this process. It's the same procedure to improve the character's strength, magic, max HP slash MP, etc. Power spheres, magic spheres, and speed spheres are needed to improve each corresponding stat. Also, every node on the grid can be activated separately by each character. This means that the character can reactivate a node already used by another character by moving to it and using their corresponding sphere. Note that locks cannot be opened at present. Another tutorial will become available once you are able to unlock them. Now that you know how to gap with your characters, let's look at the other useful features of the sphere grid. The character's current status can be displayed by pressing triangle. Okay, use this information to plan how you wish to upgrade your characters. Press L1 and R1. Oh, hello. That's uh, what's your name again? Nah, we'll just find out soon. To switch between characters, this is useful when you wish to compare the character stats or when you wish to quickly upgrade multiple characters. Press select to zoom in and out for a better view of the grid. Jesus, that's so huge. Too many grids. This concludes the spear grid tutorial. Try improving tears now. What the f Okay, let's try this. There you go. Yeah. We found some ancient ruins right beneath us. It's not active okay. now, but there should still be some power left. We're gonna go down there and activate it. And then we should be able to salvage the big prize. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get to work. Roger. When it comes to Chick, we'll get the job done. Whoa, underneath. Come on, you. Come on, you. I don't know what's your name. Well, I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna spoil the game, you know. Let's just pretend I don't know this. Ah, I need that. Steal this. Alright. And kill it. No, it's still alive. No, oh, 55. <laughs> Funny. So deep. Oh, holy shit.
Kill it! Kill it! Ah, crap! Still alive. Oh! Why is it always me? Son of a bitch! Oh yeah, sure. 1 AP. Bullshit. Underwater. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. We're gonna save this here because we're gonna end this episode. Because it'll be like, uh, I don't know, long adventure again. So. Here we go. Well. I'll see you guys on the next 